today, our leaders all still act like we well, and then wash it of this government. I did, but we finally proven a dealer, and the, but that's what people called me. But I shrugged it off. It is no more. It was the power to spoken on the Pine Ridge Reservation. And you coach anyway, 70 was going on in past the, the United Nations passed the development culturally eight in nineteen in nineteen ninety eight Ed, I still appreciate family, the whole Teox, your pet pewters. So I uh we just this and this to petrochemicals and it <laughs> So in nineteen ninety eight and then ninety nine neuralized seeds from Canada. Because they were still not doctor, but my wife had a oh, child. And so I read if you put something in it one kills that vegetable crop and and also insects. And so great that I went to Rapid City and I bought comes a person who had you walking by and and it was really exciting tree. A beautiful ceremony at Sundance. Percy and I, and Rocky, a few biggest fear people. Orphans, it was created our own Eagle Butte. I just busted and we defend our hemp. We have to go made it actually to our here. Here in our child, our Tiosh by no respect. Argo said, Mr. White Plum, White Plum, where well, within three years I could wargo. I'm gonna kick you something to do with your. I could do help Hoover. My plants were 15 sudden of hemp out of the seeds, were just they were cutting it. It was real scary. They fed one of him. He came into my field, FBI. That triggered the United States. That's treason. You had a tribal cop when again. I think our people became so low, but clear up to today, had a different outcome court instead of. In only, so we called on our Kola. He's a real civil lawyer. I'm a criminal lawyer. I know nothing about. So we did us. That shows where because the feds into apart. We tried to kill him. We were still she's saying, brother. He said, you know, we're warriors. But anyway, that second year they came and eradicated the second year three hundred eighty-five thousand dollars. So the third year, we planted against Alex White Plum and the whole Teoshpaye. That's the only time because we got support from all over the world i had people from japan come and nothing just tied on his head that's a symbol of a hemp leader same way in japan they still do that so it was real good to have all this support uh, we didn't get no financial came to be we appealed it and i went to the eighth circuit court of appeals and the eighth circuit was happy we thought they were going to rule in our favor but the eighth circuit court, that was a good ruling from the eighth circuit i wish they would have just Recognize the years not to touch our hemp plants, and meanwhile the birds ate it all around my place. The hemp field, and they were just blooming, and we had to stand on the sidelines watching 2,000 growing hemp. First time they came up with hemp biofuel, everybody said, "Ah, oh, hemp fuel." Uh, lines with the federal lifetime restraint story of. Uh, Bordeaux, too, from North Dakota. They were both U.S. attorneys at the time. U.S. federal attorney, federal judge here in Rapid City, Rapid City District, have acknowledged the treaties. So, but he rescinded the restraining order. Uh, I was back to a kindergarten. Parliament, seven declarations. So anyway, the tooth because tribal sovereignty was still supreme. Which building? So I just kept growing. We just kept at it, and 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 here act to include us in the farm bill. But what always fought them? We never feds again under their thumb. DA farm bill. If you guys under ordinance 9827, oh hemp, and ordinance 9827 is not meant number. And say this is where I'm gonna grow the CBN content. So the 2019. Congress finally passed that. Uh, go outside, just go. You're not going to hurt happen. An acre of land. Uh, and that's all I did. And that was, that was a bad word, you know. <laughs> so, and then we got 23 gallons of oil from the in the oil when you press it. And the meal, which is just the seeds, grow seed. And uh, uh, my buffaloes, they love that meal. Pinch, a little pinch of the hemp meal. And the buff, my buffaloes that chunky, and they really loved me. <laughs> I used to stand amongst my buffalo and just feel pro of straw. That's with the round bailing. And, and with that, one that was because my wife, Deborah, she has a paper. Let it grind all night, and you come out with hard, you know. It's just, but we have to make every year. Today, everybody's coming to me. Oh, magic, it's sold. It's really difficult to find buyers. A lot of that is growing hemp today, involved in the hemp board. Hemp board, so we could replace this petrochemical-made board today, 
and all she has is a wood stove, but the walls are 14, and it's still warm and cozy. And hemp has a way to let out bad oxygen, but brings so up. I wanted to share that much, and own it the American way. Uh, Americans are by one, port it. They won't report the genocide. They won't talk about it. And I don't want you guys to be that way. I made some money last year. I sold my crop. Uh, but they're still by a million dollar investor. Him and his superintendent told him, she said, my brother's using our land, but he didn't ask means as fractionated airship today. Today, if you want to go and use your land, the super tip, you have to get 100% signatures before you could use your land. And the way families can come together is get everybody that's part of that fractionated by a concept. That's what I tell him. Because they're there to stop us. We uh, but I was going to irrigate from my crib. You still have to ever to, to use that on us, the tribe. They're going to first six weeks. And if you want super strong as the hemp. And it took us too how long that is for one season. It's hard work. It's I hired 16 people. So they get out there and work hard. Uh, the leaves and the, and uh, I was going to, anyway, that was uh we collected seeds and we, we put the harvest. I, I didn't sell last year. So I want everybody to think hard before you get in last year. And and um, I made good money for another buyer. Now last year, face that. That's that. I'm doing that. Uh, the single biggest landowner, Charlie Hunkiata Hunta Semini. I recommend you think about it. And nobody's doing. No, it just remember those chipper they put in the cities they use them herds and then you could sell it on to somebody else that wants to make a hop you had to say about hemp there's nothing dangerous about it hemp. like women the paper uh -huh. uh -huh. paper uh -huh.